that somebody had been stabbed. <laughs> That's just how they said it. Summer LaRose surprised to find police outside her house as she and her family went out for a walk Wednesday night. So we turned around and came back and they told us that we needed to go back in the house and close the doors that there was somebody on the loose. 45 year old Francisco Diaz, the man police were looking for. Court records say an Uber driver picked up Diaz from this Goodyear restaurant and drove him to this Tolleson neighborhood where documents say the driver suddenly felt something run along his neck, felt a warm liquid and realized his throat had been slit. Didn't appear to be provoked or any kind of a confrontation that had occurred prior. Tolleson police, with help from area agencies, worked a few leads. Court records say they used a business card Diaz apparently left with a waitress earlier in the week, surveillance video and a series of law enforcement databases to track down Diaz near his home. And he was subsequently taken into custody there. That's scary especially in our own neighborhood. Summer says she's glad someone is behind bars, but believes it's time rideshare companies allow drivers more protections. I heard that they aren't allowed to have any kind of weapons to defend themselves. What do you think about that? I think it's wrong. Court records say the suspect told police he attacked because he believed the Uber driver was going to harm him. In a statement, Uber said what happened to the driver was frightening. You can read more from them on the AZ Family News app. Reporting downtown, Carissa Planout for Arizona's Family. Mm -hmm.